On Monday, January 10th, 2022, our most beloved Supreme Master Ching Hai set aside some precious time from her meditation retreat for the world to call some of the Supreme Master television team members and read a story from a treasury of Jewish folklore compiled by Nguyen Uk. Before the tale, Master kindly gave her insights by answering various questions from the team. Hello master. Hello, master. Hello, master. Hello, master. Hello, master. How are you guys? We're good. We're good, master. master. How is master? Yeah, I'm good. I just got a black belt. Oh, wow. Oh. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> Send to me all the way from Taiwan. Oh. No. Wow. Cool. Wow. What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> oh. I used to be with my grandma a lot. My grandma, she was always healthy though. Oh, yeah, wow. when wow. she was about my age, when I was, she was still working. Wow. And wow. I am the one who has to read story for her. <laughs> <laughs> she was always healthy, you know, and a very, very cheerful person. Yeah, she was always healthy, but she has the pain, you know, an ache in, in winter. I guess she did not have a, a thick mattress, yeah? Oh. Yeah, when I had the thick mattress before. I have had less uh, pain and aches, but no, my, I, I can deal with it. <laughs> I keep, keep moving. <laughs> I lose everything. Uh, except I just gain a black belt. <laughs> then all the way from Taiwan. <laughs> yeah, don't be happy too soon. My doctor sent it. Oh. Uh, you put it around your waist to keep warm and oh, right. wow. yeah, uh, less nice. of the pain. Something like that. Uh, Let's hope it helps. Mm. Any good news? I'd like to share some news f seen recently. There we Just a few days ago, Pope Francis criticized couples who choose pet people over babies. Again? Yeah, saying it's selfish. Yeah. What does Master think about that? I don't want to think anything at all about this guy anymore. He just blah, blah. You know, just now and then say something trendy, yes, 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 fashionable. What does he care about babies, selfish or not? Huh? Mm -hmm. For him, even killing babies in the womb or alive outside of the womb is okay with him. So what does he know about selfish or not selfish? Mm -hmm. yes. yes. These people, they just choose pet people instead of killing babies. But these other people, they just kill babies outright. And he didn't say much. Yes, yes master. master. Only one or two words. And then welcomed all the babies, murderers, into the Vatican. Right. And cold holds to them, or flirting eyes with them, winking, or blinking, whatever with them. Mm, yes, Master. So it's, it's all hypocrisy. Mm. Yeah. Yes, Master. It's just boring. Uh, boring idiot. And evil. Yes, yes, yes master. Yeah, if that's what you want to know, my opinion. Yeah, because it does make sense what he says, though. That's the thing. Uh huh. It seems like it's easier to take care of pet people instead of children. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just trendy stuff. Hmm. Okay, mm. master. He says what's in trend, fashionable, just uh. to cover up all the things, just to you know, kind of damage control again. Or oh, just blah blah on whatever the devil want him to say. No, right just enough. to keep the, the Vatican, the seat. Uh, yes. All right? Yes. 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 If he continues to, to say all the things against God, against Jesus, and then pro-abortion. Uh, but I thought his people are all for pro-choice. Mm. Yes. So what's wrong with people who choose bad persons? Yeah, true. Right. Yeah, since he doesn't condemn any anybody who kills the babies in the womb or fetus, so, what's wrong with people who choose a pet person? Yes, yes, that's true. Yeah, and they give them all love, all the animal people, poor animal people running outside there, so hungry, skin and bones and poisoned and bitten and abused. Oh my God. And now it's open to the mouth, choosing pets over babies and self. So what does he know? What does he care? Yeah. I just want the full people again 
so that people think, oh, he's not so bad after all. Right. right. Yes, yes, Master. Oh, confusing people, letting people not know what is he now. Mm. Yes. It was so evil before. So is he not evil now? Did he turn around? Yeah. Has he improved? Mm-hmm. Has he become better or converted into <laughs> godism or yeah. not? Yes. Yeah. Don't let people just be distracted and forget all about the bad things that he did. And say it against God, against Jesus, against the church, against all kind of moral standards in the society. Y esto es la historia del fracaso de Dios. This here, in this item, is the history of God's failure. Es un via crucis. It's the way of the cross. We are followers of Jesus Christ. And his life, humanly speaking, ended in failure, the failure of the cross. In 2015, his remarks on birth control broke the internet. He told Catholics to be responsible parents and not breed like rabbits. The same year he drew intense public scrutiny for calling the Charlie Hebdo terror attacks a response to provocations against one's faith. He said, if someone abuses my mother, then a punch awaits him. Six years on, he's once again in the headlines. This time for his remarks on pets. The Pope says pets shouldn't be allowed to replace kids. Speaking on parenthood during a catechism lesson at the Vatican, the Pope urged people to have more children and not be selfish by adopting dogs and cats. The Pope's remarks quickly went viral. People were quick to remind him about a verse from the Bible. Do not judge or you will be judged. Some slammed the Pope for calling others selfish, despite choosing to not have children himself. Some accused him of promoting sexism and fueling what they called the fetishization of uteruses. And others shared pictures of their pets, claiming to be proud selfish parents and expressing remorse at the Pope's remarks. There were also a fair number of responses that addressed the many issues plaguing the Catholic Church, like Catholic priests being accused of molesting children. Just another cheap, uh, low-level trick. Right. Cannot fool just uh, those uh, uh, idiots. People who have uh, intelligence, they can see through right away. Yes, yes, yes Master. Master. Anything else? Uh, yes, Master. Um, CNN also criticizes the Pope about his comment concerning couples who choose pet people over kids are selfish. And CNN says that he is wrong. The Pope is wrong? Yes. Uh, yeah, of course he's wrong. He has nothing to know into anybody's choice, into what they want to do. Yes. If he supports the choice of abortion by his own actions and welcoming these murderous entities like Biden and Pelosi, then he has no right to open his mouth to say anything else. Yes, that's right. The people who choose pet persons, they also have the right to do that. Yes. At least they don't kill the pet person. They don't kill the babies in their womb. Yes. 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 Maybe they can't afford children. They have only maybe a tiny apartment. That's all they can afford. Or they have a tiny pet person. Yes. A bird people or a little dog people. So one dog person makes not much difference. But the babies, they need more than that. Yes. So if they cannot afford that, they cannot afford better than just having casual sex and then killing the baby. Yes, 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 for yeah, sure. Yeah, so this... Uh, uh, low IQ, low life of uh, Francis has no right to say anything. He has no authority. Nobody gives him any authority to say that. Just because he sits there by cheating, by his gang to vote for him. Yes. yes. Doesn't mean he's a good and worthy servant of the people. Yes, I agree. I understand. A secret sect of cardinals has openly boasted in their pride and arrogance to plotting against the Catholic Church. The group wanted a drastic reform of the church to make it much more modern and for Cardinal Jorge Bergoglio to head it. 
Cardinal Daniels, September 24th, 2015. Op de groep van St. Gallen, dat is een soort naam die deftig is. Maar eigenlijk zeiden we van onszelf en van die groep de maffia. Wanneer paus Johannes Paulus II sterft in 2005, schuift de groep al de huidige paus naar voren als zijn opvolgers. In 2013 heeft deze groep eigenlijk wel haar streven bereikt, namelijk met de keuze van paus Franciscus. En in zekere zin kun je dus zeggen dat door deelname aan die groep de kardinaal toch wel een van degenen is geweest die de voortrekkers zijn geweest van de keuze van paus Franciscus. Canon Law number 81. The cardinal electors shall abstain from any form of pact, agreement, promise, or other commitment of any kind which could oblige them to give or deny their vote to a person or persons. If this were in fact done, even under oath, I decree that such a commitment shall be null and void, and that no one shall be bound to observe it, and I hereby impose the penalty of excommunication, late sententiae, automatic. I feel much freer now that I am certain the Pope is the Antichrist. Martin Luther You know, we call him the Holy Father. Holy Father, please forgive me. Holy Father. You'll hear that title used quite often. This man, Bergoglio, Francis the Talking Pope, his predecessors, John Paul II, Pope Benedict, John Paul I, Pope Paul, Pope John XXIII, Pope Pius. You can go all the way back, folks. I'm talking centuries. These men are replacement gods. And these men have taken upon themselves the title of Holy Father. He wears the titles of God. He yes. wears the title Holy Father, head of the church. He never died for the church, but he stole that title from Christ. Jesus said, And call no man your father upon the earth, for one is your father which is in heaven. Yet the popes took to themselves the name Holy Father, along with all claims of authority that might be assumed by such a title. C'è chi ritiene di poter avere un rapporto personale, diretto, immediato con Gesù Cristo, al di fuori della comunione e della meditazione della Chiesa. Sono tentazioni pericolose, sono tentazioni dannose. But in the Bible, Jesus says, Behold, I have set before thee an open door, and no man can shut it, and no man openeth. The Apostle Paul warned that, if any man or an angel from heaven preach any other gospel unto you, let him be accursed. Jesus said of himself, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. Yet despite these biblical warnings, the popes repeatedly claimed they were equal to and above God. It's not uh, worthy to clean the feet of a taxi driver or a, a street stripper, I'm telling you. Yes, Master. Yes, master. Uh, it's so filthy, dirty, stupid, low life. Yes. yes. And, 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 and brutal. Because if you support brutality, that means you have the same mentality. Yes, that's right. Any more questions? Yes, Master. Pope Francis removed the number two Vatican official in the doctrine office who was behind the document barring blessings for LGBTQ couples. The Vatican has forbidden blessings to same-sex relationships. In the latest decree approved by the Pope Francis, the Vatican has said that priests cannot bless same-sex unions. The Roman Catholic Church has described such relationships as, quote, not ordered to the Creator's plan. The statement also says, and I'm quoting, God does not and cannot bless sin. The church does not have and cannot have the power to bless unions of persons of the same sex. Its second highest ranking official, Giacomo Morandi, worked on the documents explaining the Catholic Church's views on blessing gay unions. The Pope is now looking for a replacement to take over Archbishop Morandi's former role in this important Vatican dicastery. Sounds like it's good news, Master. Uh -huh. <laughs> He's just a scapegoat. That's why he got to keep all the titles, you know, Archbishop, personally granted by the Pope. He's just 
find the scapegoat. He himself should be kicked out forever from the Vatican and go disappear out of human sight. Yes, Master. Yes, yeah. Master. Because if he did not approve it, whoever that number two most powerful there would not dare to have it public. Yeah. Nothing can be done without the P. Francis approval. That's right. Right. Just a scapegoat. Just a scapegoat. Ah, coward. Yeah. He has too much pressure from uh, this group. Mm, yes. yes. And also probably others, uh, a silent pressure from the public. Understand. Yeah, of course, because this is really unjust. Yes, yes. it is. When he okay, or when he let the big uh, short uh, politicians go into his private chamber even, yeah, or coat holds to them, like Biden and Pelosi, uh, who are murderers of the, the babies, innocent fetuses and, and babies in the womb. Wow, condemning gay and lesbian marriage. What the heck is that? Understand. Yes. Yeah, of course people pressure him. Now he even wrote a letter to a nun in America who uh, managed gay uh, issues mm-hmm. yeah, for 50 years and praised her even. You see, I'm just, I told you he just says trendy things. Yes, ma'am. Right. And he just about to do anything. Or maybe just to say something, do something so that people are confused as to whether or not he's the devil or he's good. Understand. And confusing people, covering <laughs> up as well as uh, damage control. Yes, Master. Ah, so sickening. Talking yeah. about him makes me sick. Ah, it's better than nothing, of course. Yes. 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 But who cares about what he says? That I told you guys before, the gay people just get married. They don't need the church. They could even go to other churches. Yes. 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 Anything as long as they want to. They don't have to rely on the Catholic Church. That's right. Even if they have been brainwashed to believe in these Catholic priests, but the Church and Christian teachings, Jesus' teaching has nothing to do with this gang, okay? Yes, that's right. Nothing to do with Vatican or Pop or Pep or People, Peak or whatever. Yes. 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 So their marriage has only to do with God. Yeah, they don't have to even go to any church or anything. Or they go to Buddhist temples. Yes. yes. Nobody demands you, nobody criticizes you, nothing. Yes. Or go to a Muslim mosque. <laughs> yeah, they also worship God there. Yes. Okay? Yes. Or just stay home, yeah, invite your friends, family, and uh, praise to God. Yes, Master. Pray to God, praise God, and thank God to bless their marriage. That's enough. Uh, I despise all these people, okay? I'm disgusted by these types of people. He and his Vatican entity. They are devils. That is very clear. Yes, Master. I cannot say enough about this. Because Biden and Pelosi, they have the power. And they use it to kill. Instead of to nourish people. Yes, that's right. Right. Children, babies, they're innocent men. And Jesus says, let the children come to me. Because theirs is the kingdom of God. Jesus said children belong to God. Children have the kingdom of God. The kingdom of God belongs to the children even. Yes, Master. And how dare they, huh? How dare they kill the babies in the womb, rape the innocent toddlers and teenagers, etc. Hmm? And call themselves holy priests? Oh, man. Many people sent a lot of roses to Pelosi, yes. begging her to change her mind about abortion. Mm-hmm. But she's still adamant to kill. Uh, yes, I understand. To murder without conscience, without shame, without remorse, believe it or not. huh? Yeah, she's adamant to keep it, to keep the law of abortion. Mm-hmm. Yes. So that she can kill more babies, so her gang of these uh, zealous demons can eat them to the pill. Oh. Yeah, she's one of them. Biden is one of them. I keep telling you. Yes. yes. Yeah. Maybe other people don't believe me, but you guys know it's so logical. Yes, we do. Imagine people use roses, use soft love like that. She's still hardened enough, hardened to the point that she chooses murder over caring and loving. I understand. And this is not 
talking about heavenly mercy is that human to human only. How can a human have no mercy to another human and kill without mercy like this? Huh? Yes. Just because you can. Yes. 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 An order to kill the innocent has nothing to do with her even. Would he, would she, Pelosi and Biden have loved their mothers to shred them into pieces in their mother's womb already? Of course not. Of course not. And now that they're alive, they're well, they're fed by taxpayers, they turn into murderers without remorse. See what I'm saying? Yes. yes this, you can see that they're devils. Yes. There's no need to be a psychic to see it. Yes. Anyone who enjoys the murderous process in any way at all to the innocents, they are devils. Yes, yes, yes master. master. They're worse than the worst criminals in the society. I don't know why the law doesn't just cut their hands and, and throw them in jail for many lifetimes. Hmm. Yeah, no worries. Hells will do it. Hell will throw them in fire forever. Wow. These people, they will not be leniently forgiven by heaven and by hell's law even. The hells have their law also. That's why they are there to punish the sinful. Understand. And these types are the greatest sinners of all in the universes. They will not get away with it. Wow. Never. They will never get out of hell again to harm others, to harm the innocent babies, toddlers and all that. And even then the Pope lets them have communion. Yeah, the holy uh, ritual of Christianity. So what is he to say? Nothing. He's a blood-dripping mouse, cannot say anything. That's right. Right. Even his shut-up is not good enough. He should just disappear. He should get lost out of human sight so that he will never support any murderous, harmful things for humanity. Yes, yes, yes Master. Oh, I can never tell you enough about all this. The World Health Organization says more than half of the European region will be infected with the Omicron variant within six to eight weeks. The WHO says more than seven million COVID-19 cases were reported in the first week of 2022, doubling the rate seen two weeks previously. On Monday, the U.S. reported a single day record of one million new infections. Fluorona is a term being coined for when someone is suffering from both the flu and the coronavirus. And on top of that, a new COVID variant has been detected in France. It is called IHU. The virus is very happy without causing any damage to the cells or to the human bodies because the longer the body is living, the more the virus can multiply and replicate. At each time the virus replicates, the risk of new variants emerge. Like previous variants, Omicron is hospitalizing people and it's killing people. And it can infect even those who have been previously infected or vaccinated. Uh, I told you, if they cure one variant, they will breed another. Yes. 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 And now they already say that Omicron is very dangerous. Mm -hmm. yes. Yes. Before they say only mild, and now it's dangerous. Many children are getting infected. Before such a young age did not get COVID so easily. And, you know, those are groups that are not supposed to be like at risk. Yes, yes, yes. They now got all this. Omicron and that sick in numbers. While the new variant of coronavirus is believed to be milder than Delta, more children under five years are reaching the hospitals in America. Last week, a record number of children ended up in hospitals across the US, the highest level since the pandemic began. This brings in the argument that whether children can handle COVID better should change at the moment since they are not vaccinated and also in the light of Omicron that causes different symptoms from the Delta, how much are children protected or how vulnerable they are needs to be reassessed. This research letter appearing in JAM Internal Medicine, it's an important piece of work because it counters a still pervasive narrative that COVID-19 is a disease of the elderly, that young people can shrug it off. True, fewer young people have died from COVID-19 than older people, but more young people have died from COVID-19 during the pandemic than nearly any other cause.
Here's a graph of observed versus expected deaths among 25 to 44 year olds in Texas during the study period. So yes, COVID-19 kills young people. It kills them more than virtually any other thing kills young people. It isn't just Texas, by the way. It is better to be young during this pandemic than to be old, that's for sure. But if you are young, it's clearly much better to not become infected with COVID-19. It is, after all, more likely to kill you than just about anything else. Many hospitals are filled to capacity. So many people who need operations have to wait. Mm. The ambulances are instructed to bring only truly serious cases. Mm. Oh. Yes. One woman who was pregnant and needed delivery, but they didn't let her in. Oh. And she had miscarriage oh. right in front of the hospital. Oh. Yeah. Because she didn't have a vaccine or something like that. Oh. Yeah. On delivery day, oh my just, just let them die outside. Wow. Oh my goodness. That's horrible. Many people die nowadays with serious illness because the hospital don't accept them anymore. Either they're too full, they don't have enough staff, many staff quit because they don't want to have the vaccine, the mandated vaccine, so they quit. Yes. Because if they're not vaccinated, they're not allowed to work. Right. Yes. 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 So for example, in America, they quit in 10,000, thousands, you know, in all fields, not yeah. just hospitals. So everywhere has shortage of staff. Yeah, one after another. I told you, they will manifest more and more variants to deal with the vaccine. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Many breakthrough cases, meaning they're already fully vaccinated, and they still got Omicron. Mm. Yeah. Yes. yeah, and some die, just like that. Oh, my God. And it's not just that. The economy is dying, mm. too. Yes. Mm. Just before they wanted to open, let it be, you know, just live with the COVID and then boom. Delta came and then boom. Omicron came. My God, how difficult can it be just to forsake the piece of meat for peace in the world and for a healthy planet, healthy humans. Humans are now an endangered species, not to talk about any other beings. Yes, Master. They're endangering themselves. They're eating themselves to extinction soon. Many people look down upon COVID. They all die. Yeah. Whoever just opens their mouth, they say, oh, I don't believe it. They don't exist. Oh, die soon. Mm -hmm. So some days or some weeks later, yeah, I read all in the news. They don't have respect for the COVID. You know, they think it's a hoax or they say, oh, it's just a little bug or a little virus and they die. Many famous people die. We're losing, losing so many famous people and so many big mouth people as well, anti-virus, all kinds of things. They all die. That's why I told you before, uh, some months ago, that you should be humble yeah, and grateful that you don't have it. Yes. yes that yes, you're still master. alive, that you're healthy, okay? Yes, yes, yes master. master. Yeah. Even disciples. If they're arrogant and if they don't meditate enough, they will get it also. Yes. Yes, Master. The COVID doesn't only come through the nose. They come through the eyes, the ears also in some cases. Right. Oh. Yeah. But mostly through the nose because you breathe in these droplets, you see? Yes. yes, Master. So if you have a face shield and you have the mask, cover the nose and pinch the, the metal trick in it to hug the nose tight, Yes, yes, yes. Then that is more useful. And it also depends on what kind of mask you wear. There are some better than others. Yes. yes. And if you just wear one layer of handkerchief, then it's useless. Right. Handkerchief and a cloth has to be many layers. Mm. Yes. And uh, some thick, dense kind of fabric couch, fabric thread. Yes. 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 Not all handkerchiefs are the same. When I demonstrate it in the tip, for COVID. I did not have any handkerchief with me. I used one of those uh, cleaning cloths, just for example only. Yes, 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 yes. How to make it quick and simple without any equipment. 
need it. But you should wear proper masks. Mm. Yes, and, masks. And even then, that's not enough. You have to wear all the uh, face shield. And you have to avoid the crowd. Mm. And avoid people who seem to have COVID or uh, sick. You can never be careful enough these days. So you just have to try to protect yourself as much as possible. Yes, yeah. Master. All because people are not careful. Take their life for granted. Even if you don't want the vaccination, because you don't trust the vaccination, you must protect yourself. You wear mask, you wear a shield, you wear tight clothes to cover all your body when you go out, and your gloves and hat and all that. What's wrong with protecting yourself and protecting others? Yes. Because wearing the mask or the face shield and all those precautions. Also, in case you are asymptomatic and you might pass it on to other people. Right. Yes. Yes. So by protecting yourself, you're also protecting others. Yeah? Yes. yes. Mm. True. I don't blame people for not taking the vaccine because there's so much conflicting information out there. Mm. And they are scared. Some people are scared. Some people are just so arrogant. Mm. Both of these types are not good for themselves. You just have to be moderate. Be more humble, more open to learn mm. more things. Yes. What is good for you? I told you, humans themselves are the pandemic. They're killing each other all the time. Yes, yes, yes. yes Master. And now killing babies, just like uh, you swap a fly person to anything. Mm. Yeah. Or shake loose an end person to something. Mm. Right. Like normal. Yes, Master. Mm. My goodness. Every year, tens of millions of Unborn or born on the day of delivery, babies die in, in anguish. Nobody defends them, nothing. I mean, some groups, they do it, of course, but this is illegal thing everywhere. This is so disgusting, so, so bloody. Ah! So hell is. All these people are responsible. And they will go to deep, deep, deep with hell. Mark my words. I'm not threatening them, okay? It yeah. will be like that. Yes, Master. Yeah. Yes, Master. If you have a wisdom eye, you will see. Some psychic people can see the hell. Some people can go to hell and see all that. All these meat eaters, baby killers, war mongers, uh, children raping, molesting, they all go to the deepest hell and being there forever and have the same thing done to them by the devils. Again, again, again. They cannot escape. God sees everything. Most merciful Master, your tireless reminders and spreading of the truth during this urgent hour for humanity evokes our utmost gratitude. Thus, we earnestly pray for the soonest possible arrival of World Vegan world peace, recognizing the priceless opportunity to save our planet. We seek to realize God's kingdom on earth by protecting innocent children and opening our eyes to the harmful powers that threaten them. May Kerry Master be forever safe and well, secured by all divine goddesses.